Hey guys, you are watching another video of Honest Hookah Review. I'm Jared, in case you didn't know, I'm and this is Danielle. This is her. <laughs> so we are just two dudes hanging out in the garage, getting all hot and sweaty and smoking it hookah. Is, it is warm. It's yeah, so. you can actually tell. But anyways, here we go again with another amazing Honest Hookah Review. So today we are going to be smoking Alpha Care. Alpha Gear Mint with Cream. There we go. Is it backwards to them? Or no? Or is it backwards to us? It's not a mirror, it's a camera. Okay, so. God. I know, I know. I'm, I'm, I'm so ashamed. <clears throat> so yeah, Alpha Gear Mint with Cream flavor. I'm really hopeful on this one. I think it smells phenomenal. I really do. Yeah, I, I'm i a big fan of mint and a big fan of cream. And, and they're both in your mouth, you love it. Exactly. Cream filled mouth. Hey, whipping cream is good. <laughs> exactly. Cream in your coffee. Exactly, yeah. See, I knew what I was talking about. So, but all right, guys, here we go. Before we get started, smash that subscribe button, thumbs up, tell us what you're smoking. That way, you know, all this hard work we have of smoking. We get a little reward by saying, wow, somebody actually watched our <laughs> stupid videos. <laughs> what is nice is it's actually a cream flavor instead of like a vanilla flavor, since yeah. there's not a lot of actual cream flavors. Yep, I agree completely, 100%. There's not many cream flavors. That's what we found. And there's not really a cream flavor. It's very difficult. So yeah. you can always find mixes like orange with cream or <clears throat> yeah. melon, things like that. Yeah, but not straight cream. I would love for Alpha Cure to make a straight cream flavor, so that way we can mix it yeah. ourselves. Because like sometimes you don't want a vanilla mix in, you just rather have like a cream, like, like a cappuccino with a cream, not a cappuccino with vanilla, you'd actually exactly. just want a cream. I agree. Just so you guys know, we're smoking out of our Ian hookah. Uh, nothing fancy as far as the bowl, it's a silicone bowl. It's almost falling apart. Yeah, it's literally breaking, but. We just haven't, yeah, we just. We keep talking it. about it, it's been like, what, months now? Yeah. Um, we use a windscreen and Coconara cube coals, which obviously I don't know if you saw them put them on, but so, boom, there they are. I think they're coconut. I don't know, they're just coconut. Don't matter. Whatever. Yeah. That's whatever is on sale. It's those. Golden Desert this time. There we go. So, <laughs> and it's not really bubbling much, is it? Although you packed the bowl, is it hard to draw? Yeah. Yeah. It's probably lighter. I think it's probably evaporated. I mean, it's been warm. It's probably yeah. evaporated so. Do you, do you want to come in? Does it need it? I don't think so. Okay. I mean, it's still drawing pretty smooth, so. But yeah, guys, we really appreciate you guys stopping by and watching some of our videos. You know, honestly, just smash that like button, subscribe, it won't hurt you. It gives us a little bit of like, hey, someone actually cared enough to watch one of our videos. I mean, we don't even get paid for this, literally. No, we're, we're losing money. Yeah. This is purely... But we're losing money by buying flavors that we're probably not going to enjoy. Yeah, true. <laughs> the whole thing with it for us is how many times him and I, Dan and I, went to look at flavors and we couldn't smell them. And then we get online and there are no reviews. Or the reviews are like junk. They're garbage. Or you smell a flavor and it smells phenomenal. And you get home and you smoke it and you're just like, this is awful. Nothing. Yeah. What it smelled like. So that's why we do it. We want you guys to get a little bit ahead of the game so that way you know at least something beyond it says, you know, cherry with mint. Because we've had how many cherries that taste like garbage? Yeah, they're just like full on artificial like cough drop cherry. Yeah. And we'll tell you that. So make sure you guys, like I said, smash that like button, hit the subscribe, and let us know what you're smoking, what your favorite flavors are. And if we don't have it in our playlist yet, let us know. Yeah. We will get it. Oh, I was going about to show them the box. Right, I saw it yeah. because the camera is on. We have a whole box. It's a what, two, four, six, eight, ten, twelve. That's big. It's like 36, 40 more flavors of yeah. Alpha Cure that we still have to go through. <coughs> and that's there's still more over here. We still haven't gone through this whole box. So we have quite a few flavors. Um, so yeah. Okay, we're back. <laughs> cooking dinner and yeah I had to go check on it but yeah guys so let's 
start it up again? Yeah, start it up really smooth. It's definitely uh, definitely pulling a lot of mint at first, but that's any mint. As soon as you put heat on it, so you're gonna yeah, you're gonna get mint right away. And once it gets actually warmed up and cooking good, it'll, I'm sure that cream will really start to come out. It's already a little bit there. It's just not fully involved yet. I do like the flavor right off the bat, though. The mint isn't overpowering. Yeah. It's really smooth. It yeah. is. It's a smooth mint, which we have. I put it all away. We have a whole kilo of mint. So yeah. we're used to mint. And this mint is pretty good. It's smooth. It's not overpowering. Let's see now if the cream develops. Yeah, absolutely. absolutely. You no, know, but so far, yeah, it's uh, really tasty. Yeah. It's just, I mean, it's like just a good normal alpha here mint, like just basic mint, not spearmint or anything super strong, just the normal mint. And then that cream gives it a little bit of sweetness and really uh, tones it down quite a bit. I'm not getting it yet. See, there's, to me, it's just barely in the background right now. It's just like any of them, once it has to heat up in the yeah. bag, it's only a few minutes in, so. Just, I'm hoping so, so much, it's just like, boom, there it is. Because it, it smells, the shisha itself smells really good. You can really smell the cream in there. It's like really, really mellowed out with the, the mint, and just like the shisha, the way it smells. Yeah. I think this would be a good one if we ever do get a heat management device that we keep talking about as well. Right. We could actually get really dialed in for the flavor you're going to have on it. Yeah, we keep. All right, it's just on a list of things like everything else. You just have the memory right awesome. No cream at all, huh? You made it taste it? It's there. It's really light, though very light which hopefully develops more and I mean the bad part guys our videos are 10 11 minutes long three or four minutes of us starting it and then smoking it so you know I've smoked hookahs where they don't even fully develop for 15 minutes you know so we're giving you guys a snip you know a little sneak peek at it best we can in a 11 minute video type thing so yeah, because, I mean, I have a hard time watching long videos once yeah. long, more than, like, a few minutes on YouTube, especially if it's, like, you're, like, all right, get to the point. Or, yeah. Well, I'm sure half the people who clicked on this video have already clicked off. <laughs> Let's just be honest. I would have, 100%. Yeah. yeah. The moment I said, Danielle, I would have clicked off. <laughs> <laughs> but... Yeah, guys, leave us a comment if you've smoked it and you got a bunch of cream flavor or if it was really strong mint to you guys. Or even better, tell us what you guys like, you know. Let us know so that we can try different flavors. And yeah, absolutely. We place an order every month or two, and it's usually 30, 40 flavors. Yeah. And we then we always have to get, like, another 250 of, like, our favorite that we smoke yeah, all the time. All the time. That's part of the other problem with our videos is... Half the time we go back to the flavors we really enjoy instead of smoking one that we haven't tried. Yeah. So, but we are trying, guys. We're gonna get more out there to you guys, and uh, hopefully you guys enjoy these videos. You got any cream in it? Uh, not yet. It's, it's, I mean, there's some there, but it's, it's mainly just mint right yeah. now. Still. Yeah. Well, maybe it'll it'll go. It'll go. And guys, make sure you check out the Ian Hookah. Um, how do you spell it again? It's uh, A E O N. Yeah, out of Germany. Great hookah, super sturdy. I mean, the thing weighs. God, what do you think it weighs? It's got to be like 15 pounds. Yeah, it is a beast of a hookah, and uh, smokes phenomenal. Easy to clean. Really, one of the best hookahs I've ever smoked out of. So check them out. Yeah, we got this one for the garage just to do the reviews and stuff in. I liked it so much, I actually bought another one for my office, so. Yeah. And we have smoked out of a lot of hookahs. <laughs> oh man, we've had like Golden Deserts, Mayas, uh, Amiras, I've had a Starbucks. hodgepodge of just cheapos and who knows what name, the list brands yeah. ones. All sorts of them. <laughs> Minis, travels, mediums, large, you name it. Man. 
I mean, shoot, we had that six foot tall hoop, I remember? That one six feet tall guy. It smelled like such garbage. Yeah, it did. It really did. But the bowl held a hundred. 150 grams. It was a massive bowl. It was a party one. It was huge. It was yay big. I mean, well, it was the size of this can, the bowl was. So it was crazy. They had what, eight hoses? It was a six or eight. Yeah, yeah. It, was, it, was, it was ridiculous. A huge hookah. I just got one of those, like, hey, cool, check out this piece kind of thing. But otherwise, it didn't smoke good. Yeah, it didn't smoke good. good. But it was a good novelty. Just it, like it was, I mean, if you want to flex on the peasants, that's the way to go. <laughs> That's good, that's good. <laughs> so tell me your thoughts so far. I mean, I like it. It's in, To me, it's enjoyable, because it's not just uh, straight mint, which I love straight mint anyways, but uh, the, the cream's very, very, very light right now, and it might not just be warmed up enough for it, but it mellows out the mint like, enough, so you'll get that, uh, the super sharp coolness on the end, where you would overdraw with normal straight mint. I like it. The cream is coming in. Uh, let's move this around just a smidge. Yeah, the cream's starting to come in. I mean, it's not like amazing, it's not bad, but it's just, it's a nice mellow mint with the cream in it. I like it. It's a yeah. very smooth mint. And that's the way I would put it. I would say, this is like a, to me, like a eighty-five fifteen mint. Yeah, it's just a little bit of a little bit of cream. In yeah, there. but uh, it's nice to knock the edge off though. I like that. Exactly, I do like the flavor. The mint's not overpowering. The cream's starting to come in. I mean, smoke is good quality. I like it. Yeah. I, I'm not going to throw this one away. So. But it definitely has like a, a little bit of sweetness that you wouldn't have if you did like vanilla in the mint versus the cream in the mint. Yeah. So what would you give it? Score one to ten. Mm, I'd probably give it a, a solid. I don't know, seven or an eight. It's because it's enjoy. To me, this is enjoyable. It's a nice mellow, just hangout flavor. It's not gonna blow your socks off like one way or the other if you really enjoy certain flavors. But it's still just it's enjoyable. Yeah, I was gonna go with a seven. Any lower than seven, I think, would be. It, I wouldn't say it's good, really. Yeah. I would say a seven is right where it fits in. It's good, it's not fantastic, it's not amazing. I'm not gonna go call home to mom and say, go buy this, but I can smoke it. Yeah. And I think I would enjoy smoking it, so. I just like that it has like a little bit extra besides the mint is what I think I really like about it. Yeah, I agree. All right, guys, well, there we are little bit past whatever time it is and uh we're gonna call this one a good flavor we're gonna call this video over and move on to our next one so thanks for watching and real quick i'll show you the box one more time here you go alpha cure mint with cream flavor pretty good we both pretty much agree seven seven Actually, and a half. i think there's a lot more cream now is it yeah and we have six right there i think there's a lot more right now I think it just takes, it takes a while for the heat to get to cream, I think is what it is. See? But there we go, guys. If you stuck yeah, all the way to the end, you got the absolute answer. Yeah, and that's like way different right there than when you first fire up, which mainly meant, like it's a lot of, I don't see, it's not creamy, it's like, like the, but it has a, a little bit of a sweeter taste. Yeah, it's a, almost like heavy whipping cream. Right. I like it. Yeah, but it's not like a strong vanilla though. It's just a nice, like, yeah, yeah sweetness. All right, guys. Well, thanks for stopping in, and we'll see you on the next one. Talk to you soon.